I'm on the Dolores Cannon Facebook page, trying to find a post that the executor of this page wrote. I'm like looking in the comments, but I just read this. I just read Jesus and the Essenes, probably one of her books. I pre appreciate Jesus in a new way. Also great info about the three Marys. Three Marys? That's interesting. Three Christs, three Marys, all these different info. It's so interesting. Where in the hell is it? It was pretty much a... Dolores Cannon passed away, and somebody who worked with her, and like pretty much like grew up with her, their name is Lara, um, runs her Facebook page. And I see, like, knock down, drag out shit about whether or not this world is a prison planet. And I wish that I could find where in the world this lady's post is because Dolores Cannon and whoever runs her page do not think this world is a prison planet. People like David Icke and <laughs> a lot of other people out there seem to think that it is. Now, I've seen some people in the middle who say that our thoughts are so powerful that if you think, once you're awake, if you think this place is a prison planet, then it is going to be a prison planet. But if you don't think that it is a prison, that you can get out of reincarnating here again. But in this one post, I mean, this chick literally brought David Icke up and said, David Icke has a bunch of people who think that this place is a prison. Yes, the Archons are real. This parasitic ass. They're fake angels. These Archons will literally, when you die, present themselves to you as a loved one or as Jesus or as anything that you're going to relate to once you die. And um, they trick you into not leaving. And it's pretty funny that they have that in a Star Trek episode. But um, yeah, I mean, it seems like if people would research Archons, the kind of what to expect when you die, it might be, might be good. And it's funny because my whole life I have been horrified of death. I have been horrified of what happens to people. Yeah, sure. Hopefully they're going to heaven, but what if not? Blah, 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 blah. I mean, I used to be horrified. Now I'm like, shit. Like, how do I die for real? Like, how do I die for good? How do I make sure that I never have to reincarnate here again? And in this post, it also talked about how a, a lot of the shit that's happening here is that the powers the be want you to come back as Christians. They want you to keep reincarnating as Christians every freaking lifetime so that the Abrahamic branch can keep control of the world and the money. It's all about money and power. But people don't understand that money is one thing, but the power is energy. Literally. Oh, I wish. 
Alan Watts. That's another name. That's another good name of information to check out. I just don't know. That's pretty much the gist of it. It just like blew my mind. It blows my mind when they're like, this isn't a prison planet. Yes, the Archons are real. But David Icke's being ridiculous saying that it's a prison planet. Well, when nobody knows <laughs> what the hell Archons are, and nobody knows what to expect, and that if you're not expecting that, that you're probably going to get stuck here again, and you're not going to be able to go home, like, I used to want to go to heaven. Does not look like a real place. I just want to go the fuck home. I feel like I've been duped in every lifetime. And, um, I don't want to do that again. Real God's us. <laughs> oh, yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. Wait, you want to see how stupid the real world really looks? Don't mind my room, but... Hey, Whisker. Hey, little piece of... God source consciousness here living a temporary cat experience. How you doing? How you doing, my guy? Huh? Huh, big boy? You wanna come get me? You wanna come get some of this? You wanna fight your you wanna fight your mummy? Little piece of God. Little little handsome God. Yeah, that's why people that beat their animals are trash. Because they're beating little pieces of God and they're pieces of God themselves. And, but they're trashy versions. Yeah, honey, right? Oh, look at my big boy. This is... Oh. Look. A little piece of God's source here, living as a rhododendron, experiencing life as a rhododendron out there. Oh, God, experiencing life as a bush. Oh, look at all those blades of God. I mean, grass. Here, experiencing life as grass. That's a game. Everything's a game. <laughs> 